There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. What's going on, y'all? So listen, you are back. You are back. You are back with the multiple strand king, Ladarius Williams, CEO and founder of the Paid in Full family. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back. Welcome back, y'all. It is part two. All right, it is part two. Okay, I told you I was coming with the social media marketing one on one. All right, and I told you we have about two or three versions of it, man. It's just me giving back, you know, giving some value out to the marketplace. There's a lot of people that are starting to get involved in their work marketing and say, because I love this profession, you know, we definitely want to make sure it's done the right way. And I want to help people in the process, man, to really be successful. There's a lot of money out here for everybody. So this is free game, free training. All right, now that I've been able to gain over the years, all right, continue to gain. I'm always, you know, in some training, you know, some seminar, some book, always learning, man. And so, you know, I invest a lot of time and energy into it, and I also like to give back, okay? But uh, we're going to dive right back into it, part two, okay? Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, y'all. You want to make sure you get notified anytime I drop videos, all right? Because I told you, not all of my videos are going to be based around you telling you to join me in my opportunity, okay? Sometimes I just want to give back, give value, all right? And I like to train, okay? My team will tell you inside of my private Facebook training group, y'all, I'm in there every single week, sometimes every single day, sometimes two, three times a day, all right, just giving value, gems, and nuggets, you know, showing them where they can, uh, you know, succeed and be successful, okay, right away. So, we're going to dive right back in, okay, today uh, we're going to talk about, uh, well, this is still social media marketing, okay, it's just, uh, it was very lengthy, so I wanted to break it down. So, let's dive in, okay, so first things first, on your pages, on your Instagram, on your Facebook, on your social media, okay, on your your Snapchat, whatever. You want to make sure if you're posting pics, which you should be, make sure your pics are clean and sharp. All right, clear pictures. All right, my uh, my mentor used to always say, make sure your lens is clean. All right, it's as simple as you know, clean cleaning your lens on your cell phone before you take the picture will make a world of a difference. Okay, so clean your lens. All right, make sure they're clean and sharp. Okay, if you don't have lighting, I tell people all the time, take it outside. If you don't have a good camera, take the picture outside. All right, but also Instagram has its own edit. So once you take the picture, all right, go in and edit the picture. All right, gives you an option to edit. Okay, uh, a lot of the newest smartphones, especially if you're an iPhone user, have edits on it. All right, but if you're posting on Instagram, it has its own edit features on there. Okay, iPhone gets the job done. Okay, now you can invest in the camera if you wish. All right, if you got the capital, you got the money, you know, just to spend some extra money on the camera, go do that. All right, it's an investment. All right, it's an expense and it's a write off. All right, if it's for your business, it's a write off. So, you know, as business owners, we look at it, we look at that, man. You know, we don't look at having, when we spend money on our business, and, oh man, I gotta spend this. No, it's an investment. All right, it's an expense, it's a write off. Okay, so perception is everything. So, if you got the money to go spend on it, go do it. Okay, you, you know, it's either go buy the brand new shoes with the outfit. Or go buy, you know, a camera that can help me take my business, help me start to market myself and look marketable, you know, in this business world that I ventured into, right? Take lifestyle pics. If there's a nice scene, take a picture. When you're going out to dinner, take a picture. When you're going to the mall, take a picture. Hotel, etc. I tell my team all the time, right? It's an acronym I use. It's called ABM. That stands for Always Be Marketing. Always, always be marketing. Everywhere you go, there's a potential opportunity for you to market yourself, okay? So, like I say, if you're somewhere nice, I tell my team, my team all the time, right? We're, we're located in Dallas, Texas. There's a lot of beautiful sceneries out here, y'all. You don't have to go travel to go find a nice place to take a pitch. Go right in your own city, find some nice places, man, and just go take a few pictures, okay, with your product and market yourself, okay? Uh, but look, I mean... It don't have to be a lifestyle pic, just bomb pics, period. Just great pictures, all right? Marketing is all about creativity, so be creative, all right? Now, when you post your picture, make your captions interesting and readable. I tell people all the time, you know, that's why it's good to read, all right? It's good to read books. I have several, uh, you know, self-development books, personal development books, you know, a lot of, you know, uh, influential people that have made it, you know, I get their books and their documentaries, you know, and read their books, so I'm on YouTube listening to them, and when they got good bum quotes, I write them down. All right, I got a whole notebook full of quotes that I use and put them with my pictures. So you wanna make sure your captions are interesting, 
all right, and readable, okay? So proofread. Sometimes y'all posting stuff, man, you don't know what you just said. Like, what? I think she meant to, or he said like he was probably about to say this, but that ain't what it was. Proofread, okay? Take this serious, all right? Now, when it comes to activity, you want to post three to six times daily. Your Insta story, your Instagram TV, the Reels, your main page, Facebook, okay? Posting three to six times a day. All right, you want to show people the consistency because they are watching you, right? But if you're not consistent enough, they don't believe you. They think, you know, they're just something they're doing for, you know, a period of time. It'll blow over. They're going to be back, you know, doing their regular stuff, sharing everything under the sun. You know, they ain't really serious about their business. When you show folks you're serious and you're consistent with it, you're going to pique their interest, man. They're going to want to take a look. So the activity, post three to six times a day. All right. Don't be scared to post even if your posts get one like. Stop being so concerned on who like it, who come in it. You just stay consistent. You stay consistent enough, you will start to get the engagement, all right? You engage with others, all right? You may want people to like and come in on your stuff, but you're not liking and coming on none of theirs. So, you know, it's a, what have you done for me lately? You know, why should I like your stuff if you don't even like mine? So take time out to like, take time out to come, come in, compliment people, okay? It starts there, all right? But don't worry about, you know, your results right away on people liking to come in. They see you, just do more, all right? Plan your weekly posts on a Sunday, all right? You can also draft them, okay? You don't know how to draft posts on Facebook, Instagram, listen, type it in on YouTube, it's very simple, okay? But plan, all right? If you fail to plan, you plan to fail, all right? So really get serious about your business and start to plan your weekly posts, all right? Like I told you, I have a notebook full of quotes and I know what I'm going to post every single day. Okay, now I might not plan it weekly all the time, but I definitely plan the night before. I know what I'm going to do the next day for sure. Okay, when you're doing product shots and videos, get super creative. Okay, get super creative. Like I said, have great lighting. Invest in a ring light, now they are very cheap. Go to Amazon, okay, and type in ring light, and you will see there is definitely uh, some affordable ring lights that you can purchase. All right, for, for the lighting, all right, you gotta take this thing serious. All right, now listen, my mentor told me back in, I want to say 2016, do videos. Video content is king, and the social media world is going to video. This was back in 2016. Videos sell, right? Videos build that no like, and trust factor. Who are you? All right? Now that you're doing a video, now I can see if we are like-minded. Now I can see if this person is someone I'd be willing to do business with. Okay, so Instagram TV, Instagram Live, you know, uh, videos in your story, Facebook Live, Facebook uh, stories, do videos, all right? You are a walking, talking billboard. You are your own commercial. You are your own reality TV. That is all social media is. It's reality TV. Who are you, all right? And why should I buy from you? Give me a video. You cannot hide behind those posts all day long. They are good. You want to post three to six times a day, but you have to incorporate video. It's just that simple, okay? Now, listen, once you start to get engaged, when they start to talk to you, don't be scared, man. Respond to the DMs. Comment, all right? Answer the phone in a speedy manner. Money loves speed. Success loves speed. So when they hit you up, respond, all right? Because if they see you and you've caught their eye, you need to respond in a timely manner. They don't take it, they don't see you taking it serious, they're gonna move on to the next. And you're gonna be upset when your, your friend or family member or one of the other business partners get the sale that you should have had, but you didn't respond. All right, so they got the research and that's all with this person doing it too. And it just so happened to be your 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 uh your best friend or your uh your family member, and now you upset. No, you didn't take care of your business, so you gotta be on point, respond to the DMs, the comments, the phone calls, the text messages immediately i had a guy he hit me up and i responded immediately he was like wow that was fast i like that oh yeah it's big business over here baby now here's some other things that you can do okay do contests all right do giveaways do 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 giveaways like for money you know what i'm saying uh the knowledge on the products services etc okay here's the thing Everybody is on some sell, 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 sell. What will make you stand out is you giving back, okay? You giving back. Serve first, all right? Serve your way to the top. I'm not telling you to give away all your money. I know you're in this thing to make money, all right? But you can be creative and find certain things you can do to give away, all right? Give, give away samples. In our business, we give away samples, 
okay? Not sure what your business model is, but find something what you can do, what you can give away something for free, okay? Now, in marketing, you gotta understand advertising is key, okay? So you can run ads, all right? Set you a budget, all right, and run ads. Some of the best in the game today, they're running ads, all right? They're running Facebook ads, they're running Instagram ads, okay? Here's some other ideas for you. Have random sales, all right? Don't be afraid to take off, you know, five to $10, man. All right, set yourself apart. So have random sales, sales for each holiday. The holidays are coming up. Have you some holiday sales, set yourself apart. Okay, some important sales to remember, birthdays. Okay, because it's this person's birthday and you know, they want your customers, listen, I got a birthday deal for you. Okay, Black Friday, right? Or when it's your birthday, because it's my birthday, you know, I got sales going on, blah, 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 blah. I'm feeling good, man. Another, another year around the sun, you know, it's my birthday sales for the day, right? Black Friday, you can run Black Friday deals, Cyber Monday deals, Christmas deals. All the big, big, big corporations are going to be running deals. Why aren't you running like a big corporation? Don't let them outdo you. Don't get out work, okay? Add discount cards to all your packages, okay? Include free gifts is a big plus, okay? I'm sorry for my spelling in there. That's meant to be gift, but include a free gift, okay? And, and, and one of the purchases. Keep your customers. The goal is, you see this in red, Keep your customers at your fingertips, okay? Now, you can do text blasts where everyone has a phone because everyone has a phone in their hand, right? And you can use easytexting.com and send blast text messages, all right? When you use easytexting.com, now all of your customers are all in one text message uh, place, okay? And you can text them all at once to blast them with different deals, different discounts, new product launches, whatever the case, you're able to text them and keep them at your disposal, okay? Have a group chat. Try to get your customers in a group chat. Add details to a thank you card, asking them to join, okay? Like I say, it's all about being creative, okay? Hold on, my apologies. One second. Let's get back. Uh, all right. That completes part one of the training, okay? We're going to dive on in the part two, okay? We're going to dive on into part two because I want to really want to make this like no more than three videos, okay? So let's keep going. If you're enjoying this, man, you're getting some value, man, give me a like. Give me a comment, okay? Give me a share. All right, but let me know if you're getting, gaining some value from this. Now listen, do not be robotic, okay? Socialize with your followers. Like I just told you all earlier, reply to their comments. Make them feel valued. And not just on your posts. Go to some of their posts. You see them interacting with you? Man, go to their wild and show some love. Okay, keep it going. Keep the relationship, all right? This, this is relationship marketing, okay? Build that know, like, and trust, all right? Add contact information to all your posts, okay? What can they contact you at? DM you at, all right? Text you at, email you at. Keep the line of communication open. Now, here is the most important part, and I should have put this in red. Follow up with all your customers. The fortune is in the follow-up. If you're in network marketing, you've heard this before. The fortune is in the follow-up, okay? Now, in person, transactions plus get in your phone, okay? In person, transactions plus get in your phone, all right? I always be in recruit mode. I always try to get new customers, all right? You can get new customers from anywhere. Okay, I'm talking about the park, the gym, the school, the hair salon, the barbershop, the supermarket, the mall, etc. You need to always, you know, be in recruit mode, always looking to gain a new customer. And I tell my team, you know, take a little time, I mean, a little money, and go buy your shirt that somebody had your product on it. They're saying, Ask me how. You know, if you're selling a product, weight loss product, you know, what's the slogan that you're running with? I just lose five pounds in five days. Or detox, get clean, get healthy. Put these things on your shirt. It's going to cause people to ask questions when you're out at these certain places. You know, what is that on your shirt? What is that about? Okay? It's going to start a conversation. All right? And you need to be ready with business cards, with samples, things of that nature. If you're in a travel company, okay? Uh, travel all around the world, you know, for the low. Ask me how. Something. I don't know. Put it on the shirt. You can get these shirts for as little as $10, you know, with what you got going on, okay? So, I'm gonna wrap it up, right? You know what, let's give you one more. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more, because this is big, okay? This is big, and then we'll wrap this up and we'll do part three 
tomorrow. I'm going to run it right back tomorrow. Types of social media posts, okay? Now, this is very important. You should know your audience and know what they like, okay? You should know your audience, all right? I add people every single day. I delete people every single day, okay? When I add people, I'm going to go see, you know, but really before I add them, as long as they're not private, especially on Facebook, I go and see what type of person this is to see if they're even credible, you know, to be in my audience, right? You select your audience. This is your business, all right? And so some people, you already know, you can tell by their posts, man, this person ain't about nothing. They, you know, it's just all negativity, fights, you know, uh, sex and drama. And I, man, you don't want all that on there, man. And so next, you know, you are disqualified, all right? So you should know what your audience like, okay? Promote posts. Boomerang, new product tees videos you name it right and the boomerang is just like a new a, a little feature on your stories that you can use you know be creative okay but you want to promote your post okay you want to do new product lunches new product come out tease them a little bit oh we got some coming blah 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 blur the product out you know and and post it be creative videos all right videos is definitely key all right when it comes to a social media post nothing is better than videos nothing okay behind the scenes all right, your, video, your videos can be on behind the scenes, you know, post office, you packing orders, photo shoots, etc. All right, do videos about this. All right, if you got, you got a photo shoot going on, do a video. All right, you want to get on behind the scenes of how you, you know, prepare uh, your, uh, your product. You know, uh, if you are going to ship orders, you know, do videos. You go into the post office, how you pack your orders, whatever, man. Be creative. You can do a video on almost anything, okay? Expand your mind. Take time out of your day and write this stuff down and figure it out. All right, inspirational posts. It's important, okay? Don't just be sell, 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 sell on your social media platform, all right? Inspire people. People come to Facebook, all right, and to go up to social media to be inspired, all right, to, to, to be motivated, all right? There's so much going on in the world. So the fact that you got inspirational posts that can uplift them, all right, is a plus. It's a win, all right? Customer testimonials, okay? Uh, you can do reviews, all right? emotional posts okay and when i say emotional posts you know you know talk about you know where you was to where you're at now all right people fall in love with that you know because they, they probably can relate they probably have been there right lifestyle posts all right are very important vulnerable posts habits you want to break like be real with your audience people love authenticity they love that realness give it to them okay you can't be afraid give it to them i'm not telling them telling your deepest secrets but take them there, open up, and show them, hey, I'm an open book, man. I have nothing to hide. They want to do business with those people because they can trust you, okay? Share new products, all right, slash services you're working on, all right? Celebratory posts, all right, something you've accomplished. But not only something you've accomplished, something your business partners have accomplished, okay? Post that. People want to see, people want to be around a winning environment. Are you winning? Are the people around you winning? Share that. Okay, your goals. Don't be afraid to put your goals out there on display and share the world. Tell the world, hey, this is what I'm going after. This is what I'm about to achieve. And this is what I'm doing to get it, business-wise and personal. Okay? And like I said, this kind of goes back to what I spoke on earlier, relatable posts. Share something that others might relate to. Okay? And it's just you opening up, being real. Okay? Funny posts. How will it, man, listen, it, it, you got to have balance. All right, on your social media wall, okay? So have some balance. Put something funny out there, man. Not too too corny and geeky, I guess, but you know something funny, man, that you know will cause a laughter and cause some, some more interaction outside of you just posting business, all right? And then you can post questions, you know, like where do you shop? Where do you shop for? You know what I'm saying? Like where do you shop for your vitamins? You know, where do you shop for your teas? You know, well, where, where do you, you know, when if you're doing a travel business, you know, like where, where airlines are you going through? X, Y, and Z, what type of hotels do you like to stay at? Ask questions, all right? Because the questions are going to create that engagement, which is going to boost the algorithm, and more and more people are going to see your posts, okay? So that's going to wrap up this one. Ladies and gentlemen, we will do this again tomorrow. Like I said, if you got any value from this, let me know. Let me know, all right? Let me know in the comments below, all right? More and more videos are coming, all right? I hope you got something from this, all right? pause play rewind write this stuff down same way i did you i was in a training just like this where those nuggets came and i created my own training okay but well, these are things i already do every single day 
and you can do it too. All right, you just gotta do it. See y'all on the next video, man. Boy.